Jason Inlaw here and in this video we are going to take a look at how you share a distribution list in Google Contacts or Gmail um, after you've created it. So how you can share it with a friend and you can both send the same emails to the same contacts in a much easier way without both people having to make their own distribution list or group or label or whatever you want to call them. So first of all, when I go to contacts.google.com, that is the URL, contacts.google.com, um, it takes me to the new version, the new preview version. Um, currently, I'm sure Google is going to pull through on this one, but right now what they've got, is it just doesn't work for me. Um, it's very difficult. It's difficult to add in um, contacts. It's really hard to make a group, um, so no thanks. So you've got to scroll to the bottom of the menu at the left all the way to the bottom and you're gonna find a button that says switch to old version gotta do it gotta switch to the old version really no choice here gotta do it um, once you're in that old version life is going to be a whole lot easier for you so I already made a group or distribution list um, in the last video that I made called the Radley McAwesome group so I'm gonna click on Radley McAwesome group on the side here and um, what I want to do is share that with my friend. I want everybody to be able to send emails to the people in my Radley McAwesome group. In order to do that, I'm going to click on this button up here that says More. Um, I am going to export this list. When I click Export, the v very first thing, the default, is that it's going to want to share all my contacts, all my contacts, all 1,327 people that I email on a regular basis. No thanks, don't want to do that. So you've got to click the button that says the group because I only want to share the Radley McAwesome group with the person that I'm going to share this with. After that, you're going to click export. What this will do is create an Excel CSV file um, that you can share with a person. Now there's lots of different ways you can share this file with the person. I'm going to open it up real quick. You could share this person as an email attachment. You could share it with the person by putting it in a Google Drive and just sharing it that way. You probably have lots of great ways to share it too. Once you share it with the person, however, um, here are the steps for them. So I'm going to pretend that I shared it with them. I'm going to pretend that I um, got it to them either as an attachment or in Drive or whatever. They have it. And them is actually going to be me. So that's what we're going to do now. So I'm going to click back on Chrome go back into my contacts and this time I want to import the list so I'm gonna click on more again I'm gonna click import because I want to select that file that was just created I'm gonna choose my file it went into downloads it was called Google it was called Google 2 CSV I remember because I saw it I'm gonna click open you can see it there Google 2 CSV I'm gonna click import and then if everything goes well you're gonna see there it is the Radley McCossum group or whatever the distribution list is called sitting there under your contacts if you don't see it this is totally possible don't freak out everything's gonna be okay all you've got to do is click the refresh button to reload the page near the top and bada bing bada boom it's gonna show up there for you trust me it will just try it that is all you'll notice now I've got double <laughs> got to combine those. Um, that is how you export and then share and import distribution lists so all your friends can have those same contacts. Thank you so much for watching and goodbye.